2022 World Cup. Number one, Erling Haaland. Surely one of the biggest names in world football right now, Erling. And the truth is, this might not be the only tournament he'll be missing out on because Norway are not regulars at the World Cup at all. They've qualified for the World Cup only three times in their history and never in the 21st century. But then, if anybody can carry a country to the World Cup, surely it's Erling Haaland. And he'll have the help of the likes of Martin Odegaard. So let's see how 2026 goes. Timo Werner. Werner missed a big chance to go to the World Cup as Germany's main striker. No pun intended. His ankle injury just came at the wrong time. Timo. Anyway, these are just 10 superstar players who are missing the 2022 World Cup in Qatar. But there are many, many more names. Marvin, Tony, Obamian, Kessie, Sancho, Ossiman, Luis Diaz, Jorginho, Donnarumma. Spain centre back was denied the opportunity to say farewell to the World Cup in Grand Star by Spain's boss Luis Enrique. When Ramos left Spain for the World Cup in 2018, he surely didn't think it was going to be his last one. He was just 32 after all, but with Enrique leaving him out of the squad for Qatar, it only means one thing. Ramos played his last World Cup game in Russia against Russia. It could also mean that he's done with international football completely. Ibrahimovic initially retired from international football after Euro 2016. Thank At God that the brothers on the rise now. Ooh, the the end. All of my but then house. it's yeah. Slap to have a talk about here, so is it now. him at the end? Yeah. He came out of retirement in 2021, joined Sweden in the World Cup now. on a fine campaign. He assisted them with the goals and qualifiers, but they just weren't in it. Sweden ended up losing their World Cup ticket to Poland, so we won't be seeing Slap to have in another World Cup. And we know we must ask him if he's ever been in Slap to have a show. This has to be the end of the World Cup.